How planning a wedding can end, end your, your marriage? marriage. And this sometimes it, it's like those things might show up later, so you have to trash it now. Number four or so, what I think can affect your marriage is money. What's money? Oh, money. <laughs> Most of British. Money. I speak British. <laughs> Man. <laughs> See, it's money. See, money is. Anybody that tell you that money is not important, run away from the person. That person is an agent of property. Money would test your your resolve. That do, are you serious about getting married to each other or not? Which is why I said that. You see all this. Uh, I want to use this one million all. I want to wear this uh, damask clothes. I want to wear this shoe. If you cannot have, 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 afford, afford it, it, leave it. And wear what you can afford. And you can always come and do another wedding. We now we have another wedding plan. We plant. have another wedding. Maybe we can invite. When we can invite, invite if you like, we want to come. <laughs> You will chop and you will go home. But at that time, we knew what we wanted to do. We can't afford it. Yeah. Even if your pocket is big, money might be the reason why you are not going to marry when you are planning the <laughs> wedding. So, dear wife, dear wife, what happened to us? When your husband is saying that, you know, I have a cousin that can do this wedding dress and do it better and do it great. At an affordable price, other than the three hundred fifty thousand one that you see online, believe that your husband. Because when you now My wear dears. the wedding dress, you love it. My dears, person tell me say in causes have you make wedding dress, mm. and as I then tell me, she was not posting anything online. Mm -hmm. I did not see any proof as to why this thing was being hyped. Believe. Meanwhile, I had proof of people that I was seeing. I was just thinking about it. But in my head, Social media when tellers. somebody has already brought my cousin and you have not married, you now want to say, no, that is the beginning of family problem. In my head, I'm like, let me even just go and see what this girl can do. Another thing I want to tell you, you see all those tailors that do posts. <laughs> they can sew. <laughs> they can sew. Debbie Lavina. They can so oh believe mm. you know timmy mm. timmy um timmy Lane is my cousin and um she's the um creative director of devil Lavina. and she my own cousin made our 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 wedding dress and our wedding anything everything, you see well, everything, well, 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 everything. everything she made it and they were him. they were so so perfect beautiful and most importantly affordable <laughs> affordable so they were affordable don't spoil our business they were affordable because it was hello for us now hey, she if, you carry, if you go there it's, no she's still affordable, she's still affordable yeah. but don't 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 say she was she will not give family price hey, no 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 but she one more she one more she one more she's my family she's my family. She's my family. <laughs> see she gave me i knew she was going to give me family price and every couple can't at that time and she did a good job. Like, I'm, I'm going to put a picture of the wedding dress in this um, video just to see what I'm talking about. You know, but what I'm what what what, what I'm trying to say is that it, she and I use our own tailor. I use yeah, our own tailor. She has own a tailor own. that can do a guy's dress yeah. that did my that the suits that my you know my um, men mm. men wore. I you know the guy that did my own suit, uh, Abraham. Uh, you have moved into real estate now. Oh, nice. Yes, yeah, and you don't run away from Nigeria. Now. You don't. Yeah. You don't. Uh, why do you want to kill him? <laughs> you ran. You ran for his dear life. Um, but anyways, but so that that's be ready to make compromise because you see, one of these things that we are saying, I'm picking jokes, picking yeah. situations. Uh, we are trying to pick situations so that we can do examples, so that yeah. you will see it when they begin to happen. You know, because they will happen. If you hall can call oh, venue, I mean. The day we went to go and check that big hall behind this star. What's yeah, the name of that hall? White hall. Uh, white, white sands. White sands or something like that. Behind this star. I forgot the name of that hall. Uh, Oregon area. Mm, it's forgot really the, big. B really big hall. And we got there and then we're like, I think it was we're four million. Well, I think it was four million mm. um, the, to, to get the big hall. Like, just think about it. Already, I've used four million. Four million already on the. We're not talking to people that can afford it too. You know. Yeah. No, funny enough, at that time, I remember that some of my shout out to um, the um, Akinremi, mm -hmm. um, um, you know, shout out to um, the Onkwakin tools, uh, shout out to the Moraki. I think I had people that were 
No. To be say, you get married. Oh, let me write you a check. Let me send you money. Mm. Big money. Out of that money, now what do you want me? Like, yeah. Yeah. All this money that I'm getting, you know, some foreign currency. Some of my fans online have called me and said, you're getting married. Let me say this, this, let me say that. I'm like, why should I even go and use my money to go and impress anybody and invite people that doesn't like me to come and see whether my wedding will be sweet or not? I said, like, hey, let's, let's, let me carry only my family and friends to a particular and if you didn't make the list it's not, it doesn't mean you are not a friend though it's just that <laughs> you are not friend enough at that time or the list did not cash cash you do you get what i'm saying uh, i couldn't I afford family members eh, but doesn't mean you don't like them now eh, up you to love them I'm still begging. <laughs> up to today me i'm not begging I'm, I'm, it's because I, I think anybody that is angry that you didn't invite them to your wedding reception just because you cannot afford it is your enemy i i i would think so because I told you the reason why I'm not inviting people is to I cannot afford a large wedding. If you think so, bring the money. If you can't bring the money, I'll like you while you're away. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, while you're away, just stay on your own. So, please, um, dress, money, list, parents. Uh, we were lucky. We were able to talk to our parents. Yeah, and they understood. And they understood. Because some parents would not understand. They will think your husband is trying to do this. They will think your wife is trying to control you. Both sides learn to speak for each other. Yeah. Girls learn to defend your husband to be from your parents. Yeah. And if you have parents, like a no. father that will give you a list, you are the one that knows your husband. Talk to your, talk talk to to your, your father. father. Have a relationship with him before the wedding. That, Say, that this, he, this boy that cannot, cannot afford this thing. Not that you, you, you if, uh, happily want, you want to give my husband to be doing. this just because you want to prove to the people in the area that he has money. What will I be eating will, in the house? Yeah, the wedding will finish. Even your daddy will not be there. Do you get? And, and so, men, defend your wives with, you know, especially your mom. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's your wife that said that we should not do it that way. No, mm -hmm. we have decided. have decided. It's our decision. As a matter of fact, Nami talks say, Make we not do them that way. Because at the end of the day, the wedding is for you. More importantly, the marriage now now only could stay inside. I just with the benefit of hindsight, we have thought about it that imagine we had wasted all of our money. Mm -hmm. uh, the normal wedding then would have cost us some good millions. And oh, shout yeah. out to Lemony Touch. Uh, yeah, that was our planner. event planner. Um Adiola. Um Ceci at that time. You no, know, she's not she's married anyway. But uh, Lemony Touch did everything like with the available budget we got the best with that hundred people 120 yeah. something people that came for the you know for the buffet of our of our wedding reception it was yeah. perfect so what do you have to add uh, especially to your fellow women about <laughs> that wedding so that wedding will not stop their marriage it's very easy to be um carried away and want to have all the fine things of life because the number of things that i googled and i saved on instagram on how I wanted my wedding to look, I had to compromise and I had to sacrifice because I knew what my pocket was. Not because I couldn't have afforded no. it, <laughs> but because I had a bigger plan. Because if if I had done what I wanted my wedding to look like, I wouldn't have afforded moving out of Nigeria because there was proof of funds. There was things that we needed to do that. <laughs> If we had done, if we had done everything, what we would have borrowed? You, you <laughs> even after borrowing the money, you now come to the country <laughs> cannot do anything. Hello, Bolowa. So, I had to put <laughs> my desires in check for those things. Now there's going to be another wedding, and I cannot afford. So, guys, so there will be another wedding. Yes, very soon. Very soon, you'll be invited.